What is up, everybody? This is your host, SuperSign, and welcome back to another video. And in this one, first of all, disclaimer, I don't know much about computers. I don't know much about the technical stuff, but... Nevertheless, it doesn't stop me from getting really excited about them and enjoying them and researching them, even though I don't know much about it. So anyway, I'm going to show you what I, just me, and it probably easily disprovable as to, well, what about this factor? So I am aware of that. But anyway, I what I consider to be the absolute, the best value CPU. This CPU is an absolute unit. And let me show you why. Okay, so come over here to good old Google, and we'll go to this one right here. And also, my live streams and that. Oh, this is what I mean. Oh, yeah, and this silence one stopped again. This is what I mean, right? You're coming down here, right? Say, so I have 200, 334, right? Okay, so we'll go rows per page, and we'll change it to 50. Okay, change it to 50. Not a problem, right? We scroll down. Now it says out of 305. Wait, what? It, what happened to the other ones? If we go across a page, let's see what happens. So we're going to, to page number two. Now we scroll down, and all of a sudden, there's 285. It's like, wait a second. And that's what I mean. It just, it's just really random how it kind of does that, and just sort of... I don't, I don't know why, and then if I do it again, I don't know, it might stay the same this time. It doesn't seem to stay the same. This is not related to the video. Yeah, it keeps changing, but anyway. So, we come over here, and anyway, we go to CPUs, and you can sort by value, and I think it would divide the price by the average benchmark. And if you go to, to, to not to average benchmark, that's insane. Okay, there we go. If you go to value right here... Kachow, this one here, an absolute unit. Like, I mean... It's a solid average benchmark, and it's literally, like, it's just so, it's just, it's just such an affordable price range at 115. Like, like, these ones here are all valid options in that. Like, this one here is a good option also in that. You know, but, you know, oh, you know, these ones here are good, but, of course, very expensive in that. But this one here comes out leaps and bounds ahead. And it's just a, a Chihiwi i3. I would even consider it for my 24-7 streams. That's, it's just so cheap. And if you compare it to what, it, like, the capabilities, like, for 115, that's absolutely insane. So if we click on this right here, and if we bring up what I've currently got, which is an i5-8400, this one right here. So we'll go like this. Not the fairest of comparisons, but look at this. Oh, okay, so, well, for the 8-core, yes, it is faster, which and I would be doing to 24 7 stream, so that would be important. But, I mean, like, this here, this is, like, this more than double the price. I mean, it does have six cores in there, but more than double the price, you know, and it's, and, and this here, like, it's, it's, it's negligible. You know, effective speed, 2%, which is, is very, very negligible. You know, average user benchmark, 7%, which, I mean, it, it, that is important because it is for the 8 core, which I would be using. But, I mean, for, like, literally so, so much cheaper, so much cheaper. So, I just think this one is an absolute unit. I reckon it's, it's just so good. It's just such a powerful one in that. It's just so good. For example, if we compare it to another one and we go to, the was it the i five two four hundred and that like these ones here you know and if you compare it like this 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 one here outperforms them by fifty percent and that you know and it, I I just I just think it's so good value I honestly do I just think it's an absolute like it's just it's just such a good choice it's such a good choice for like I'd say most people like obviously you know gamers will want something more than that but I mean I don't know I reckon that would handle gaming I don't actually know but and it would depend on what type of gaming and that but for most g generic use for most people you know like into like you know emails, you know, watching YouTube videos, you know, all that kind of stuff, that would be, this here would handle it just fine, and this is for $113, so it's like, you know, what going forward, all, all in one PCs, let's put that CPU in it right there, because I mean, that there is just incredible value, $115 for, for what it is, that is just absolutely insane, so, you know, it has come out, you know, fairly recently, I just think it's, and this, this is kind of what it looked like, I think it's changed a little bit, because I was looking at this back in October, I think, thing uh, or October around then around October 2019 and I thought the same thing I'm like that was because this one here again was leagues ahead although this one here when did this come out when did this one come out okay there we go Oh, yeah, mid, so, you know, that would have been there, but, yeah, I just, I still think that one is just absolute winner, like, undoubtedly an absolute winner, and I, I am seriously considering that one there for my 24-7 streaming computers, just getting, like, like, a, a few of them, uh, like, with that one, and, like, a, a cheap, like, if we go to the GPUs, and we go over here, and we go to the val uh, value GPUs, is that the best way to do it, and with maybe this one right here, either this one or this or, or that one there, there we go, and have them, although it's, that's, uh, that one was an F, not a KF. Anyway, but yeah, anyway, so something like that. Just a real, like, less than $1,000 setup, hopefully. 
and just absolutely beautiful for streaming. But anyway, and so that yeah, we'll see. Anyway, I just thought that I just thought that was an absolute winner of one, and I just want to show you that in this video. So have a wonderful, beautiful rest of your day. I hope you enjoyed it. Do let me know in the comments. Do you think that that has any merits? My like argument for it. I don't know. Let me know. See ya.